Hi guys, my name is Nicole. Welcome back to my antique booth, Green Onion Vintage. Today, I'm just gonna share with you a quick walkthrough of my booth. If you have been here before, you're gonna notice that a lot of the furniture has changed and we finally had a really good month of furniture sales. So there's gonna be a lot of new pieces for you to see. And for some reason, we just have so many smalls. We've really been shopping. Um, my mom and I do this booth together. And so we've had some really great finds lately. And I've been sharing those in my Goodwill hauls especially. So if you have not subscribed yet, make sure you have done so so that you can see all of the shopping hauls that I do in order to upsell them for my antique booth. Um, so there's gonna be a lot of new things to see as I walk through here. I'm not gonna talk too much about prices this time because I really just wanted to give you a look at our booth as we prepare for a big tent event. That normally brings in a lot of new shoppers to the store, and this is located at my treasure house in Edwardsville, Illinois. So I'll have their location and Facebook page linked down in the description box below so that if you're local to me, you can come check out the tent event. I'm not gonna show you the tent today because it's rainy and nothing is set up out there, but I will share with you a walkthrough um, either Friday or Saturday. Uh, at that point though, it'll be too late for you to come shop there, but I do want you guys to be able to see what it looks like. So maybe you can check it out when we have our next tent event, which is normally in the winter. And then of course we'll do another one next spring. So that's gonna be coming out in the next couple days. But we typically have extra stuff in our booth considering we're gonna have so many extra customers. So I thought I would walk you guys around, let you see everything that's new and just how full we made our booth with such a busy shopping weekend coming up. And make sure you stay tuned to the end of the video. I'm gonna give you a little bit of a sneak peek of all the DIY projects that I worked on to get ready for the tent event. You're only gonna see a couple in the booth today, but most of them are out in the tent, just waiting to be seen on the 6th and 7th of May. Um, so I have a lot of DIY projects to share with you that I've got done just in time for this tent event. So I'll give you a little look at those at the end. And then a couple of the pieces my mom brought in for the tent sale too. And then I'll have a full DIY video for all of those projects and those pieces of furniture um, that will be in the next few days. So I'm already working on that video for you guys too. So lots going on around here. It's been a really busy week. And of course there's rain for our tent event, but that almost always happens. There's either rain or storm or just a lot of wind. We even had a snowstorm hit kind of early once for one tent event. So we're not too surprised here, but it does make it just a little bit more difficult for shoppers. But Saturday, May 7th looks like beautiful weather. So if you wanna come check us out on Saturday, our hours are 10 to four. Sometimes we close the tent a little bit early, just depending on the weather. So if there's a lot of shoppers though, of course we won't close it. But if you wanna to try to come maybe in the middle of the day, um, and we do get a lot of sales, sometimes right in the morning, we have people kind of waiting to get their stuff. And especially if we have a rainy day on Friday, I think Saturday is gonna be really busy and a beautiful shopping day. So. I'm going to let you guys look around now with just some music and then at the end I'll tell you a little bit about what I worked on for the tent sale.
I hope you enjoyed just looking through what we have in our booth right now. I hope you can tell that we've been really busy lately, just trying to get stuff ready. Um, we've been thrifting a lot, antique shopping, um, and I think it's paid off. We have a really nice and full booth for spring, lots of greenery. So I'm um, really just enjoying this time of year in our booth and trying to use a lot more color than we normally do. So I hope you guys noticed all of that. Um, this is a tent event from last year, just a little picture here. And just a reminder that the event is six, the 6th and 7th of May. So I mean, we're talking like tomorrow and then the next day. So this is a little bit of a last minute video for you, but here are some of the things that I was working on this week to get ready for the tent and like i said before i'll have a full diy video of all of these furniture flips for you and some of the iron orchid design projects that i do as well as some antique upcycling projects it felt really good to get some of that stuff done a lot of it has just been kind of waiting in my garage for me to get to work on it and i really was able to get busy this week and focus and get a lot of projects done for this tent sale so i'm excited to share this video with you it has been a while since i've done a full diy tutorial um, but I think some of the things came out really, really, really cute and um, are some different things than I've done before. So, I mean, similar projects to the past, but I definitely had some fun doing some different techniques with some of the antique upcycling projects. I just haven't gotten around to doing yet. So here's just a very quick little glimpse at everything that I worked on for the most part. That's almost everything. And then I wanted to show you really quickly also uh, the pieces that my mom brought in. So this is a chest of drawers. It's painted in the Mojave yellow from Dixie Bell, which I do sell on my Etsy site. So if you guys need somewhere to purchase your uh, Dixie Bell products, um, you can get them from my Etsy site. So she used a Dixie Bell stencil on the front. And then this is also Mojave um, with another Dixie Bell stencil. They have a gingham stencil that came out really nice. So she did a yellow and white theme for this one and for the chest drawers, and they both came out really beautiful. So those are both gonna be in the tent this weekend also. Hope you enjoyed today's video and I will see you in the next one. Thanks so much for watching. Bye guys.